1 million. Squarespace for sponsoring this video. Good morning guys. Today I'm leaving to Busan and I'm really excited because I still haven't left Seoul yet during my whole Korea trip. The last time that I went to Busan was five years ago. This is our hotel room. It's so nice. I need to reveal the view. This is our view. Once again, we came on a gloomy day to a hotel. Last time I went to the Namsan Hotel, it was also really gloomy. But today it's raining. Hopefully the sky clears up later. You can see the bridge and then this is Heonde Beach. And then this is the washroom. Oh my god, I think there's a TV on top of the tub. I just finished doing my makeup because we're gonna be going out to eat now. We're probably gonna be eating some hae, which is sashimi, one of my favorite foods. In Busan, there's a lot of seafood and fish dishes because it's near the ocean. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen the ocean in so long. <laughs> I'm literally balancing my camera on a hot sauce oh, bottle. Cool, cool. <laughs>
So I'm in the bathtub now. I wish I had like bubbles or a bath bomb. But after we ate, we came back to the hotel at like 7-ish. And then I just fell asleep in my makeup and lenses. And then I woke up like literally 20 minutes ago. But can we just talk about how cute this bathing suit top is? Feels very relaxing. I'm gonna turn the TV on too because there's a TV. I'm scared that my camera's gonna fall into the tub though. It's so close to the ledge. I forgot to bring my makeup remover, so I have to just try to remove everything with this cleanser. <laughs> It's 11 p.m. now, and I've just been snacking on some chips. I'm kind of hungry, so I'm looking for the menu for room service. I'm gonna get this, which is the Hanshik set, and it comes with like myokguk and some pantan. We can't really go out to eat right now because there's so much thunder outside and it's raining a lot. The food is here, and it looks so good. There's myokguk, and then there's also some seafood and pantan. There's also tea that came with it. And some fruit. This food is hitting so hard right now. It's so good. Like I told you guys earlier on the train, I have a canker sore on my tongue, so I have to eat everything on my right side. So I shove like the food to my right side and only chew with my right side. The second like something spicy or hot touches this side, it stings so much. and now we're walking to a restaurant bow in my hair to match the dress for playing and hyphen <laughs> it's so sunny I can't even see what I'm filming to this place it's also a popular tourist attraction I forgot the name so i'll put it on the screen but basically this part of Busan is really uphill so the taxi ride was so uphill but let me show you guys the view it's so pretty this is the view from the cafe it's actually insane i love it here so much it reminds me of like being a Studio Ghibli film. And I always love places that just remind me of Studio Ghibli. It just gives me like a feeling of nostalgia and it'll keep it like emotional. I got an orange aid. I never get coffee when I come to cafes. <laughs> such contrasting music they were playing like peaceful classical music and now they're playing zoom you can even see the ocean from here right there
So it's the next day after my Busan trip and I'm now back in Seoul. But today I have a few plans. Right now I'm going to be heading to I Park Mall to meet up with Ella. After that, I'm probably going to be meeting up with Brianna and her friend Vanessa. This is my outfit for today. I forgot I packed this dress, so this is my first time wearing it out in Korea. How are you guys today? Comment down below. I okay. went to E-Mart for the first time. A mint chocolate chip almond. <laughs> I left Ella and Christina like an hour ago. My shoulder hurts so much right now. The strap is so heavy. Can you believe it? Hashtag Canadian reunion. We came to this restaurant in Cheongdamdong. This is like a more like expensive area of Korea, but we did not expect it to be this expensive. My stomach is ready. Look at all these side dishes. Oh my god, look at all this food. My camera's gonna die. So I wanted to quickly pop in and thank Squarespace for sponsoring this portion of the video. So Squarespace is an all-in-one platform for building your business or growing your business online. Squarespace has many great features like the mailing list or blog posts and the ability to have online stores. I think having an online store within your website is super helpful, especially for someone who is growing their small business. There are also many different templates to choose from so you can engage with your audience or sell something online. So if this interests any of you guys, make sure to head to squarespace.com for a free trial or you can head to squarespace.com slash serangho for 10% off your first purchase of a domain or website oh my god my lips hi guys hi guys so it's been a while since i've filmed anything or like picked up my camera i actually got sick two days ago yesterday i got a fever and really bad body aches it's not covid i've just been staying in yesterday and today i'm currently eating dinner i just got product and a triangle kimbap from the convenience store and i also stopped by the pharmacy to get some meds for my sore throat i have five days left I have five days left till I'm leaving Korea and honestly I have mixed feelings because I truly enjoyed my time here but it's also been really long and I do kind of want to go back home, be in my own room and in my own bed. I've also been really burnt out and my sa- I spent like from 12pm to now on TikTok. Ah! Okay, there's something wrong with me. I don't know why I decided to randomly film right now. I just felt like updating you guys because I feel like in all my Korea vlogs, I'm just always going places and like never telling you guys what's on my mind. Now I'm just watching YouTube while eating. Oh my God, it's a mess. Sometimes when I'm bored, I like watching my own videos. <coughs> right now I've been watching my old videos while eating dinner. <laughs> I think it's a nice way of like looking back at your past and just like reliving memories. This was right before I left to Korea. Oh my God, the cicadas. I think that's what they're called are so loud. Hi guys. Oh my God, my voice. Please don't mind my voice. As I said before in this video, I did get sick and a sore throat, but now I lost my voice. But anyways, today's a really special day because I just hit 1 million on YouTube. Wait, actually I hit it yesterday night, but today I'm gonna be celebrating it. I got a cake and I'm gonna be taking Instagram pictures with it. I'm gonna be going to a cafe to take these pictures because I can't take myself seriously with this voice. There's not any place in this hotel room where I can take like a nice picture. But yeah, I can't believe I hit 1 million. I didn't expect to hit 1 million this fast or even in Korea. Korea. I don't know how to express how shocked and grateful I am So I just wanted to say a huge thank you to you guys for making my channel come this far I hate to say this with this voice right now, but it truly means so much to me Like words can't describe how crazy this is to me and without your guys' support and love for my channel This wouldn't have even been possible and as cliche as it sounds I always dreamt of being a literal youtuber ever since I was a kid I grew up watching beauty gurus back when I was in like elementary school school and middle school so the fact that i now have reached 1 million on youtube is just so surreal so yeah once again thank you guys so much i got my cake and it's so cute the owner of the cake shop gave me this packaging i'll show it better later when i'm taking pictures oh my 
my god, it's so windy right now. I'm walking to the cafe right now. This is my outfit and then my slides because I didn't want to wear like sneakers. Since my feet aren't going to be in the pictures, oh my god, I can't get used to myself with this voice. <laughs> They're so pretty. I got a rose bouquet. I still haven't eaten the cake yet. I've been taking pictures for like an hour now, but I'm gonna be eating this chicken pesto sandwich. This looks so good. I'm back on my hotel. <laughs> I'm back in my hotel room, but seriously this cake is for you guys. <laughs> oh my god, you guys, I just got the cutest package from Cleo. They sent me flowers and a cake for 1 million. Today's actually my last day in Korea. So I just spent time with my grandparents, but Cleo sent me this package today and I was not expecting it at all. I'm so shocked and so happy to show you guys better. They gave me this bouquet of pink roses and what's so funny is that I actually bought pink roses myself that day when I was doing the 1 million photo shoot. But there's a little note here it says 1 million chikko ije 2 million kajua. So thank you so much Cleo. And then this is the cake. I still haven't opened it. I'm gonna open it right now. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, this is the cake. I guess that's me in the middle. It's like a selfie from my Instagram, but I'm obsessed with this cake. I'm still so shocked right now because I genuinely wasn't expecting cake and flowers from Cleo. This is so pretty. How do I eat this? Wait, I'm not even kidding. I thought these were real flower petals, but now that I'm looking close, it's icing.